being able to break stuff down on a nightly basis. You're as good as anybody. Uh, th this might come as a shock. How can I teach the game but simplify it so that everybody you know, at home watching can actually see it on the ice? Palacios back to the track. Plenty of room to haul that in. Taylor is out. Freelick. I had the same conversation with the Atlanta Thrashers uh, announcer, Darren Elliott, with my dad. First pitch. It's lined into center field. A base hit for Freelick. Runners first and second. Like, but it is an escape. Yeah, and I think that's the key to all of it is uh, having a good time. Game starting to slow down, Brad, for him offensively. Uh, we talked about that in the line. Talking with Ollie in Baltimore, and he was just raving about the batting practice that he took, where he was really concentrating. It'll come. It's about getting comfortable, realizing how you're going to be pitched. He's getting a lot of soft stuff away, a lot of stuff the other way. That one is swinging bunt back to the mound, and Peralta climbs the hill and throws. And then when it is, well, you have somebody track it down like Freelick did in center field to Tommy Edmond. That play was ridiculous. Is it a strike? And 0 and 2 for Newt Barr, who grounded out on the game's first pitch. He surrendered two singles tonight and just struck out Newt Barr, his second punch out of the game. Two up, two down. Game, you might give up a couple of runs. If you only have to score two or three to win, that takes a ton of pressure off of your... To that bullpen who's been so strong here for the Brew Crew also. On the strength of their pitching. Brewers have not been a great offensive team in ERA. And look at that ball explode away from Goldschmidt. A one, two, three, third. Has struck out two, walk two. Pitch on the ground to second. And a piece of cake takes care of Santana. Batted before, but he credits his daily work with Willie McGee for his progress. And there's been a lot of it. From an outs above average defensively. He he's has made tremendous strides. Yeah, he's worked at it too. And it's a new position. Strike for Mark Canna. He was robbed by Arenado. A great running catch and foul ground to start the second inning. Arenado again backs up this time takes a beat throws a strike six ground ball outs Including a first inning double play well, That's exactly what you want to see in a Dios on the run still coming he dives hit pop center and Adamas will stand at 2200 for Adam And that's a touch low first Brewer runner Excuse me the second Brewers run Perfect pitch. What a weapon that is to have. And skipped up there. Three balls and a strike. Up now the pitch. And pulled foul. Boy, he had him off stride. That's just remarkable. It's squid foul at third. Yeah. Try to go back door with the cutter there after. Sinking. Saw these on a fan in Atlanta. Said we got to have these. Well, we have them. Warm. <laughs> Super warm. <laughs> you know, to tell you what kind of a to do it for the interview, but they've been on all game. Probably shouldn't have done it for this interview either. <laughs> to come to think. Those have been undefeated. High pop down the right field line. That is buzzing for Peralta. And Wayno, and there's strike three, four strikeouts for Peralta. But as you know, Brad, sometimes it's not how you pitch, but when. On a roll. And keep it fair. He did. Ballpark. He got out of the ballpark. Has given Wayno a lead. An absolute missile down the left field line. Broken back grounder to first. And Santana has no trouble with that. Donaldson. Swing, ground ball to third from one third sacker to another. One pitch, one. Now you would really love. Driven toward left. Richie on the run near the line. Eight games. Brewers are happy to have this guy healthy. He had elbow problems, got a. Touch low, even count. 
right now. Well, Uncle Charlie's got the feel for that. After you saw Adam throw his first two breaking ball adjustment. Squib towards short. Look at the English on that. Win stays with it and win. Career win number 200. In the St. Louis fifth, it'll be. A bullet hit toward third. Donaldson off balance throw. Long throw and a grid. Whatever Milwaukee lacks in offensive punch, they make up for it with pitching and tail of it. Edmonds, the man to hit that deep drive to center in the. Contreras came out of his crap. Pitch is a great one for him. It is again. Delivers a 2 2. His hammer through the hole, a right side base hit for Edmund. He's hit the ball on to play with and didn't get it. Strike one. And took a shot that way. Good try, but a little late. It's 0 2. Pause the pitch. His way high. If Peralta makes a mistake to Mason, though, and right handers that way. Inside out swing. Good approach. And he fights off a tough. Two two. Strike three. Wow, not a strike. Jim, 96. It's a good pitch, but just appears to be off the corner. Your Chevy pitch track, the young man. And out of play foul for a strike. Schmidt here. And out of play. It's 0 and 2. Here it is. And he checked his swing. Two balls, two strikes. And with the slider, was it? Couldn't drive that. 96, bottom of the zone. And the sixth inning. He threw just nine pitches in the fifth. And he's got the. Little chopper, wind charges, big hop, big arm, and there's. Away and Walker will play that on two hops. So William Kinch tying Bob Forsh for most ever by a Cardinals pitcher in franchise history. And now it even ball two. Ground ball right at the bag. Step on the bag. There's another double play. 